Yo, I ain't here for the money, I ain't here for the fame. So it might be nice to own a jet plane. What is going on guys, my name is 4G, so today I wanted to make a video talking about the brand new 15.50 update for Fortnite, uh, because this update yeah, definitely has some more interesting things than the 15.40 and 15.30 updates that we got the last couple of weeks, so that is definitely nice, and also, really quickly, if you do enjoy the video and you do enjoy Fortnite videos like this, make sure to hit that subscribe button and hit that like button as I do upload videos like this frequently, and without further wasting your time, let's jump right into the video guys. So the first thing I want to talk about is the Golden Touch Challenge Pack, this challenge pack is the female Midas skin that everyone's wanted for so long ever since it was teased back in early chapter 2 season 5. Definitely really cool. What will be included with this pack is the skin of course, the back bling for the skin, a pickaxe, and challenges for up to 1500 V-Bucks if you complete the challenges. Definitely very very nice. Uh, it'll probably be around $20, similar to the Dark Love Ranger skin, and yeah, I'll definitely most likely be getting it. Alright, the next thing I want to talk about is the classic LTM with Chapter 1 loot, early Chapter 1 loot specifically, and I think that this is going to be really cool. I know we already have a uh, classic LTM of some kind, but this is Somehow going to be a little bit different. Uh, I'm not too sure exactly what the differences are, but regardless, I think it sounds awesome because as someone who's been playing the game since preseason of Fortnite back in September 2017, uh, I do miss the old days of Fortnite for sure. Basically what it will include is the pump will return, the original pump, not the spaz that was added into in season 7. Uh, the smoke grenade, the boogie bomb, the bush, which is awesome, the semi-auto sniper, the hand cannon, the burst, and scoped ARs will all be included in this. I think this sounds amazing. I'll definitely be playing it. What do you guys think about this? Leave your thoughts in the comment section down below. So the next thing I want to talk about though is the hand cannon has been vaulted. Unfortunately, I hate to say that because I absolutely love the hand cannon. Definitely my favorite weapon other than the heavy sniper or the bolt sniper. Um, and I hope it returns again in the future, you know, in the actual game because it's definitely a fantastic weapon and I did have so much fun using it. The next thing though is that they did unvault the rapid fire SMG, that is what uh, will be replacing the hand cannon. I don't think that really equates. I think the hand cannon is way better than the rapid fire SMG, but you know, to each their own. Um, what do you guys think about that though? Are you excited to see the rapid fire SMG and how do you feel about the hand cannon being vaulted? Leave a thoughts in the comment section below with that. Uh, the next thing is the PS Plus pack. Uh, brand new one is coming very soon. It doesn't have a skin so far. Or it could have a skin, uh, but it's most likely encrypted. If it does, we can't really see it. But what it might look like is something similar to the emoticon for this pack. So there's not too much to talk about here because, of course, we don't know what the skin looks like just yet. But regardless, look out for a new PS Plus pack coming soon. The last thing I want to talk about, and this is definitely the most interesting in my opinion, is that the zero point is destabilizing. Uh, as it looks right now, it definitely looks like it is. And this just gives me Season X vibes, and I think that that is great because Season X, in my opinion, is definitely an underrated season, definitely an amazing season. Uh, so what could this mean for the map or for the game itself? Uh, it could mean that the old map is returning, possibly, hopefully, you know, always sitting here with uh, hope about the old map returning, but there's no guarantee, of course. Uh, it could be just something, you know, new POIs coming onto the map in the future, you know, in next season and stuff. Uh, it could also be the old map and the new map cut in half, something, something interesting like that. Who knows? I'm definitely very interested to see what they do with it though. But yeah, that's gonna wrap up today's video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to hit that like button as it greatly helps out the channel. If you're new here, like I said in the beginning of this video, uh, make sure to hit that subscribe button as I do upload these videos frequently. And if you guys would like to support me, make sure to use code YouTube. It's 4G in the Fortnite item shop. I do get a small portion of that sale if you do use my code. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great day.